All day, man. You know what it is. Random Order Show, episode 147. Ain't me and me in the building. It's your boy Jermaine Richards in the building. Amen. Hey, Love you, baby. Train the bit to awesome. Yo, man, I'm just here with the one. The thighs. I gotta call with something better. Amen, hey, man, man. We got my man Sean Sebastian in the building. Talk to him, huh? Yes, sir, man. Back. Still chopping. Maybe more chopping. Listen, man. Very wholesome episode we have on our hands, people. We talked about all the important things you want to hear us talk about, man. Huh? Aliens and shrimps. <laughs> <laughs> Aliens and shrimps. <laughs> <laughs> Lounges and powdered eggs. Little glizzies. <laughs> <laughs> Manure and shit. <laughs> All the hard hitting topics, man. Damn back bumps. <laughs> I'm serious, I'm serious. Trey's film camera experience. And of course, man, smoking on that person pack. <laughs> 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 you gotta see for yourself, man. You gotta check it out. Yo, put a beat on, man. All out. Put a beat on. That one ain't it. Hip hop club beat. That one, I'm gonna tear that shit up. Y'all get up on your ass right now. <laughs> get up off your ass right now. I said, get up off your ass right now. Sneakers. Tie your sneakers up. Get up off your ass. Mm. Tie your sneakers up. Get up off your ass. Tie your sneakers up. Get up off your ass. Tie your sneakers up. Get up off your ass. Stop chilling like a biscuit. <laughs> Stop chilling like a biscuit. Hey, Stop chilling like a biscuit. Hey, Stop chilling like a biscuit. Get hit in your beetle. Get hit in your beetle. Get hit in your beetle. They made a song. Yo, someone said Sheldon was Don Cheeto. <laughs> This guy's we apologize <laughs> for these rhymes. Man, we used to have it back in the day, man. I can't ah! even. <laughs> Put a beat on. And that's oh it. That's all I want. Ain't no that's beat change. All I want. Bro. Ain't no oh, beat listen, change. I'm gonna change. Press play uh -huh. and hover over the X, man. That's the only button I could press. After okay. That. <laughs> okay. We gotta show these niggas why we number one. Uh, this one I chose. <laughs> yeah, you gotta rhyme on this. Yeah. All this. right, listen, man. Come on. From the heart, it's from the pain. That's all I gotta say. I shoot guns like Max Payne. I go over yeah. here, do that in the rain like Max B. Yeah. Nigga said free Max B. I said don't. Yeah. Cause Trim. he a bad man. Hey. Unless y'all want me to free that man. Free okay, there. Go ahead, free that man. Shrimp. I'm chilling like a shrimp on a glass. Shrimp cocktail. That's yeah. my pass. Okay. Yo. Patron. Patron. I sip Patron. They call me Taste Maker T, and I don't sip it on Patron. Matter of fact, call me P P because I'm launching missiles through my P. <laughs> <laughs> hey, brother, you might want to get that checked out. Oh God. For real. Yeah. Oh y'all don't y'all don't do that. <laughs> y'all not pissing on black girls. <laughs> y'all not doing that. Put me on. Coming at you live through a rainstorm, man. Yeah. We push through the elements to bring y'all greatness, man. Can't nothing stop us except yeah. for God. If He came down and if the lightning hit just right, <laughs> then through it's the gonna window. shut all this shit off. It'll yeah, break the yeah. circuit, man. Speaking of breaking circuits, I want to start off by saying I'm coming out with my own circuits, and I'm going on tour. I think it's circuits. I did. Yeah. And circus? Yes. You ever been to, you been to the circus? Yeah. Kind of, right? We went to the circus. Didn't the lion eat someone out of the circus that we were at? Yeah, that was, no, that wasn't. That, was that on happened TV. though, right? Yeah. I lived through many lifetimes, I think. Yo, probably, man. Oh, yeah, that was, man. Uh, Seek Freedom Road, yeah. So they like, have a lot of wild animals that, not wild, but the, the animals that they use in their show. And they use tigers and lions okay. or whatever. I don't know if they use lions. I'm pretty sure it's tigers. But okay. uh, one night uh, during a show, a tiger again went and bit one of them in the middle of the show where oh. people were. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was, it was pretty bad. And like it was like all over. And like, but they were saying how like afterward, they were saying how like it wasn't like a malicious, like the tiger's trying to kill me kind of attack. Mm. But. Who knows, man? Honestly, yeah, I've, yeah. I've never worked with tigers. Mm -hmm. I have no idea how right. that could have went down. They did bro. PR for the tigers. Yeah. Yeah. He's not the tigers. Not yeah. not a bad guy. Listen, we talked to the tiger. I was reading. Yeah. They picked him up by the neck and was like dragging yeah, him around. Yeah, it was bad. It was bad. It was pretty. Uh, yeah, and yeah. he survived that. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. that's fucking magic, man. That's, that's, yeah, that's, 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 that's pretty. That's a real magic trick. Yeah. Talked about that. Yeah, that's um, who did it. You know, I was about to say yeah. Siskel and what the fuck did Ebert? Drake say? Yeah. Siskel and Ebert. Yeah. Three out of ten for sure. You know what I'm saying? Trust me. Siskel and Ebert thing. Dog. Yeah, I do recall seeing an elephant ride a tricycle. Now we did. We did. We went to the circus elephant. when they went to Brampton. They were in Brampton. Oh, them boys. I forgot what them, took them us, brothers yeah. or whatever. Them. Some I niggas. Was, yeah, was, I just saw turn. a bunch of elephants walking on a tightrope yeah. or something like that. Yeah. Bro. <laughs> that was a yeah. too crazy thing. <laughs> that, <laughs> that fucking blew my mind. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> like, imagining an elephant on a tightrope or even on it a It was tricycle. doing some crazy shit, man. Yeah, I've seen that in cartoons for sure. Maybe that's what I'm mixing in. Yeah, I think you might. Be. But it was elephants. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was yeah, doing yeah, something, yeah. man. That is. I'm not you saw that. that footage from Real TV featuring the Mod Rashad, where he was a um, Mod Rashad. Who's that again? Basically, you remember Real TV? Who's Real man, TV? Man, you know Mod Rashad. Yeah, 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 yeah. A Mod Rashad. I thought you were talking about Mod <laughs> Shumpert. I remember a video of an elephant, a circus elephant, just fucking. He just said, "Yo, man, today's my last, last straw, you motherfucker." <laughs> my last man. circuit, man. It's my last circuit, my last go around. <laughs> and he just started trampling people, just going crazy, and just flipping shit. Yeah. Thing is, an elephant could do that. Bro, the whole every every second you're alive around an elephant, it's showing Being mercy. Grateful. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's showing y'all. I could. Yeah. Yeah, I could really crush you. Get out of I'm not from Toronto. <laughs> <laughs> literally crush like, you. Literally. Yeah, but ultimately, yeah. the uh, police had to bring out the Miami's, load that really trunk really up, man. It was pretty sad. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, go ahead. Now you good, bro. Like, go? I should yeah, go? Yeah, go oh, ahead. no, I just, I just, it, so, you know, me and Jermaine got our visas, right? And. I, I, for some reason, I didn't get my proper visa. Like, I, I just had a piece. Of, I printed my paper. I printed my shit out. Mm. He had some shit in the email in the in the mail. Oh yeah, I remember this. Yeah. When I travel back and forth, I kind of get in trouble sometimes. It'll be like, yo, this is not like, you know, when someone holds something that's like so legit, <laughs> but they hold it like it's a piece of like, mm -hmm. what is this? Mm -hmm. They held my paper in the way where it was frolicking, and I'm like, bro, stop holding my shit. Like that. I'm like, hey, hey, man. This took time, man. It took time yeah. and money. What is this? this is like, you know what I mean? Just two oh, fingers. Two fingers. Hey, oh, nigga, just better God. thumb and index that shit. <laughs> man, it's, it's, so I, I didn't get mine, but Jermaine got his official one. So I've been getting yeah. like grilled on like not having my official one. So my manager now tell me, like, yo, I heard back, ooh, dude, this is the price that you can pay for it. So I'm thinking, he's saying, you can get you can pay four sixty five for a physical copy, and it may take four months to get over here. Is that okay? Oh my god! So I'm like, oh yeah, hundred percent. Because me and him always thought like you would get a, like a, card. a physical card, like to say we're here. Because mm -hmm. he has a paper too, and he's like, no, but no, I have no. Like no. A, I have like, I have like a certificate paper, and yeah, I thought it was like a physical, like a card. You get it with your picture and everything, whatever yeah. when you cross. So that like, we got it. Like, oh, congrats. I'm like, where is it? It's mm -hmm. like, oh, just go to the border with the certificate thing. And then on the paper, I'm like, okay, cool, cool, cool. It's legit. This is not a visa. This cannot be used as a visa. I'm like, so what do I do? I'm talking to the lawyer. Like, yeah, just go to the border and show them this and you're good. So I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm all right. Mm -hmm. He has a scanned version of this. So it's one level down. down but, you know what I mean? mean? So I, so I take it to them. I, I like hesitant to hand it over to them. I'm not too sure what's going on here. They take it. Okay, cool. Where's yours? You grab his. This is Pete. What is this? <laughs> like a fucking dirty sock. <laughs> so you see, and you see how it makes me feel. So anyways, I'm asking for for the, for my physical copy. He says it's four sixty five. So now I'm thinking it's a card. So I'm like, okay, like that's fine for me and Jermaine. Like run it so we have that card. I want no problems coming in and out here. Just yo here. I don't even. I shouldn't be able to. T I don't have to say a, a word to you. Mm -hmm. That that's the type of steez, like, you know. Yeah. Then he says, "No, it's four hundred sixty-five for the paper that you have." <laughs> but you have, have that paper, paper, no? I have a he photocopy. Has a scanned version of that for some reason. Uh -huh. But I'm like, they're even giving him problems about it, and I'm just like, so, bro, where are the rules here? I feel like America's just making shit up. Yeah. Just go ask him. Go ask him. It won't go be the first him. time I'd heard that. One. Oh my god, <laughs> yeah. man! Four sixty-five. Nah, you better type my number, baby, and you will find me. You just gotta show up a little earlier, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know? just be ready for the bullshit. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. Just factor in the bullshit, and if there's no mm -hmm. bullshit, then you're chilling. Anyways, I, it's only when you get that one-off officer, man. Like it's true. 
I just want to be travel one day and then get a bad one and I'm done for. You know? Just get reamed. Yeah, get you're fucking, fucking reamed. Oh no, reamed is something else. No, that's yeah, that's a totally different that's activity. Totally different. Yeah. So, does you ever wonder why your knees hurt? Yeah. As, you, as you begin to age, man. Uh, mm-hmm. All the time. I never wondered why. I've just been sad about it. <laughs> I feel that, man. Well, yeah. sometimes finding out the truth will bring light to your sadness, if you will. And you just see how you caused the demise of yeah, your Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, this Mm-mm. may explain. Mm-mm. Ah, uh, yeah, uh, you remember? Uh, yeah. yeah, Sheldon. Yeah, <laughs> you Sheldon might... remembers this for sure. My knees don't yeah. sound. That's why you don't remember. <laughs> My knees don't sound like that. <laughs> <laughs> for the Lucas record, really I've never knees jerked it. in my life. Yeah. For the record, cow. No cap. <laughs> cap, man. Cap, man. Young people really he do be putting that, their knees through yeah. it. Yeah, that nah, facts. Not again sturdy. It's a wrap for y'all niggas. Yeah, it's a wrap. Yeah, like what in, in the history of humans? Like it's just crazy that you know, as long as humans have been around on this earth, they've certain humans have never seen that. Yeah, that specific so? dance. That's just, who the fuck was yeah, jerking? You, know, you go back, yeah, you, you go <laughs> oh, right, flip right, back right, as right, many right, pages right, in the book right. of life, man. You will not see the damn right. pin drop, joint <laughs> drop. You're not yeah. seeing a pharaoh do that shit. Like, you know what I mean? You're not <laughs> seeing the Viking do that shit. You know what I mean? Uh, they just had other, what are we eating tonight? Us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Duh, God. You got the skinnies and everything, man. Fuck. What I, a time. What is, I I didn't, that didn't hit me like that. The skinnies ain't hit me like Yeah, I had some skinnier nah, the joints. The skinnies hit me. But it wasn't for jerking, though. The skinnies just hit me because. How was it more comfortable? Different. They weren't. They weren't. It's right. like it's your skin. Yeah. And they were hard to find when I was trying to find them. Skinnies? Yeah. Yeah. Like, unless you were, like, going to drop, like, mad guap and shit, which I was at, as a 16, 15 year old kid, I didn't want to do that. But, like, blue notes, like, blue notes, like, you had to, like, they weren't at every blue note. So mm. It was weird, man. It had the weird skinnies yeah, and shit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, um, the straight leg skinnies. Like, you know, you, you want them. I wanted my shit. Like, yeah. They were even making skinnies. They were just making yeah. tight pants. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. And it was weird, though, because the legs would be mad skinny, but then the hips would be like. The waist fit. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. Waist yeah. Fit, yeah. It was weird, man. I was watching a TikTok, a get ready TikTok. Do you say you bought some jeans from Blue Notes the other day, no? Walmart. That's what it was. Okay. Mm-hmm. Real deal. Yeah. Is Blue Notes still around? They are, yeah. Right? Okay, okay. There's one in Bandley. Dog, Blue Notes had jeans. Yeah, for sure. Blue Notes had drip. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't know how it goes drip. They had jeans. <laughs> they had and cargos. they had them. Blue <laughs> Notes had drip. Because they, they had need... jeans. They, oh, man. You know they had, no, they no, had no, cargos. They had graphic tees. They had graphics. They had, they had what? Flannels. That says Blue Notes on it? Nah, they had, nah, they had like collabs and shit. You could get like superhero. I had like some superhero tees from there. What? It'll be like an old school yeah. comic superhero tee. I do remember that. I had a Superman shirt yeah, for they, some reason. Mm-hmm. I never really like liked them. Never. I was like trying to get into them. Yeah. Oh, Blue Notes. It was, it's just a you know what I mean? They got the jeans up. It's the same with the they, rock tees. Yeah, like, the yeah. rock tees. Yeah. And the NASCAR tees. Like, I don't wear none of them shits no more, bro. It's just a steez at the time. Yeah. I went to Plato's Closet. Whose? Plato's Closet. It's like a- Oh, uh, here? No, nah, in Canada. They have that there. They have that. Yeah. Oh, they have that here. Yeah, yeah, right yeah. across from and the gym. And they do consignment. They it's it's like EB Games. They gonna rob the shit out you mm. like for, for clothes for clothes, bro. Mm. But they don't take everything. Mm. You know, EB Games they gonna, they gonna pretty much take everything. But I brought like a bunch of shit, bro. I I even brought like all my babe shit because I'm trying to get rid of all my babe shit. So I just like oh, fuck it. Let me see what they'll give me for it. They probably won't give me what I want, but I'm gonna see. And like all this other shit, some Lacoste shit. Gave them a whole bag. You got to leave the bag there for them to go through it. Left the bag there. Come back. Just took all my NASCAR tees. That's it. And everything else. Gave really? Me bag, bro. Yeah. <laughs> gave me like 27 bones for like seven t-shirts. What are we at yeah, time, bro? We, 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 we can't authenticate the babe, so we're not going to take it. Bro, you guys should have a specialist in here. That yeah, what you talking yeah. about? You're missing out on yeah, these like, great deals. The fuck? Nah. And then, yeah. I could have threw that shit in the garbage and made more money. <laughs> <laughs> Facts, fucking man. compost tax or some shit. I'm yeah, my Depop might be up by the time y'all see yo, this. Real bag, deal, man. Yo, real deal, man. Yo, if you're down to real. Depop and I like, go through the troubles of like I'm photographing and everything and mm-hmm. you know what I mean, listing it in a look a one two promo. Bro, yeah. bro, there's, I made my account, so I did that. Is. But this is why I'll tell you why Depop is will pop you, man. Mm-mm. 
I said, Depop dot pop. Yeah. <laughs> Depop wants to like, don't force me to be on your app or your site. Say mm-hmm. like, why? Explain. Like, Bro, okay, I had a Depop and I went crazy. At one point, we just had too much shit yeah, and I used to start Xbox. going up to this. Yeah, I used to what you need so, yeah. man. <laughs> yeah. I'll get that taken off your hands. Yeah. Didn't I sell to your out. Xbox to somebody for you off Depop? Oh, you think you sent it to someone, right? You said, yeah, you, yeah. you sent it. I bought, I sold it, right? And I think I like brought it to the person. Brought it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they were in Brampton or some shit. I was a demon. I was a demon. I was deep. I was deep. I sold the Xbox on Depop. Pop that dog. shit off the D. <laughs> dog. <laughs> you can deliver on Depop? Yeah, if you can. No, 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 no. no, no he the, dropped it off. Yeah, like, I just dropped it off. Because mm. I guess he probably just did the sale through Depop, but then it's like, you don't got to pay for shipping and shit. Because he told me, he's like, yo, I'm in Branson. Can you drop it off? Oh, okay, okay. I said, I said, I won't. I just thought like on some like he paid you for shipping. You're like, but why would we pay for shipping? Like, no, yeah. you're not. Yeah. It was one of those. It was like, yo, you can just like drop it off. I think I may have said, I said, yo, I can ship it or I can just drop it off. Mm-hmm. And then Shells was in Brampton at the time. So I'm like, yo, next time you come here, you want to take this Xbox. Proper. That's funny. We used to send Shells away with hella shit uh, <laughs> downtown. If we had extra chocolate or whatever, like, yo, yeah. take this. To this day. Yeah, literally, <laughs> bro. This extra shit has to go yeah, distribute it. Nice. But, the, Deep no, <laughs> no. Deep pop, what they do is like if so. I I had uploaded mad shit on there, and if you don't use it, they basically tell you oh, we're shutting the website down, like mm. we're shutting your account down. So mm. they're forcing you to use it, and if oh, you're not using it, your account's gone. Really? Okay. So I saw a hella drip on there, had my ratings. Then they just took my account away, man. Like fucking Airbnb. Damn. Oh what? But it's like. Yeah. You just gotta be on the app Or you gotta sell shit on the app You gotta be selling shit on the app Oh that's crazy So, so I guess selling or buying shit Yeah like Damn, You just, I can't just have open to it log in yeah. Nah that's crazy What the fuck You have to be logging in like Let me check them Maybe they already closed my shit Cause I made it like last week <laughs> I ain't touched it since Nah I'm probably not that soon Nah nah Not that soon That'll be arms up. Yeah you know what I'm saying <laughs> I remember it got funny Cause I started selling things And then people were tagging me And shit I just sold them Like don't do that And I was just yeah, like, like that. wearing it Keep it low I'm like bro just go where yeah like, live your way. life yeah man but at that point depop wasn't even like that like reselling your shit wasn't even like that i feel like now like it's a lot more accepted mm. like people are they're like yeah. you know i don't know I just there's certain things i would donate and certain things i'm like okay, i'm gonna sell i can't throw this away right? yeah yeah like for sure like even yeah. even like yo i haven't worn in months i just can't i can't just mm-hmm. give this away bro <laughs> yeah, yeah it's worth <laughs> something i'm yeah, giving you bones yeah mm-hmm. like you gotta give me so that's why i went to play those so i'm like yo i don't wear none of this shit no more but Fuck man, I took twenty seven dollars. Nigga mm-hmm. bought me some pizza and shit that night. Like at lock least, in, at least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. at least, you hit that shirt. You know what I'm saying? Bare <laughs> man. Depop got that shit because I got my camera off Depop. I got, I bought my contacts off D- Depop, mm. and I remember the girl just had two cameras and she didn't know which one she wanted, mm. and then she decided she wanted the other one, so she was selling her contacts. But mm. she was trying to go on. I love when someone's trying to go on a trip mm. and they're just willing to get it off. Like yeah. To fund her trip, right? So she well, told me, take it off your hands. Yeah, yeah. Nah. catch a nigga slip. <laughs> but they be particular about the prices. Mm. Nah, she was she was like, yo, I'm about to leave today. I just need some bread. Bought it for six bills. And I remember how amped I was because yeah. the contacts is like two racks. Great cameraman, yeah, for sure. Two racks or something to shit for it. I got that whole offer, six hundred Canadian, man. Are you still in the film and shit? I broke my fucking camera, man. Right, Golly. broke my heart. Yeah, my. I just found a T3 that I'm getting, um, but it's, it's it's yeah it's like a it's one more it's a newer from the T2, but mm. it's it's like more recent, less problems. T2 breaks mm. a lot, mm. but I didn't notice. I got my T2 maybe in like 2016, oh, 20 maybe like 2017. I got my T2, I think. Yeah, it's 20. That's a, that's a, almost 10 years. Yeah. Wear and tear. Yeah, this right. Yeah, but. Um, yeah, I know. So I had to, I had to stop. But also, when I was shooting film, we we're going like everywhere, man. We we're traveling a lot. We we're doing a lot of shit for the first time in the city. So it was like, all right, here, here, here. Then COVID happened. Mm-hmm. We weren't doing shit. Mm-hmm. Moved. We weren't doing shit. There's no <laughs> trust. Me, there's nothing to photograph <laughs> them. Yeah. Uh. Uh-uh. Thing is, there is, man. There always is. There always is. Yeah. We were down bad. It's gonna look. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No. Nah. Like an inspiring yeah. moment. Yeah. Ah, this. Yeah. <laughs> I remember. Yeah, but now it's bad. Now I feel like it's all right. There's more time to yeah, more things sure. to like film and shit. I wish I brought my camera to Wales, man. It was beautiful out there, man. Yeah. Or even Portugal. Anywhere, yeah. man. Just record, taking pics, but it broke. I gotta get it fixed. There's only one guy in the world that fixes it. In the world. 
in the states. Oh, unless you're sending it to Japan, but that's that's, that's not that bad though. What? Postal service is pretty good these days. Nah, bro. To one it's man, one though. man, like fixing everyone. Everyone in the film world knows about this guy in New York. But you think everyone's camera is broken right now, type shit? Anyone I'm sure he's loaded film? up. Yeah, uh, this nigga's backed up for I would, sure. I would, have you give it a try though, like it, to send it to him? To like reach out to him? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to drop it off personally when I go there. I mean, time's already. You're, you're not with it right now. You could just yeah. be not with it. And he True, it could be on the <laughs> way. <laughs> it's, it's, with a, it's with the cameraman, the sec, my cameraman in Orlando. So he was trying to fix oh, it. Oh, he's trying to fix. Okay, but it just. So happened that this is how life worked. Mm. I broke. I didn't. I didn't break the camera. <laughs> the camera broke. The camera just broke. But you my broke hands. it. Okay. If someone <laughs> dies in your hands, did you kill them? It's no, it's internal. Exactly. But, no, no, no. That no. gear <laughs> was internal. Oh, internal. Internal. Okay. Did you drop it a couple of times? Under- hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure I heard that shit smack. Yeah, I dropped a couple it. Times. I dropped it, but it's gonna happen. But it's a. It's made of titanium. So you broke it? No. <laughs> <laughs> you caused it to break. It, I had the camera since 2017. Man. You got the it's, wheels rolling towards a broken camera. I took pictures. After you picked it up off the ground, <laughs> continue to stress it up. <laughs> yeah. When you put it that way, fuck, man. Me. Yeah, it happens. It happens. It happens. Mm-hmm. But it, it's just, it's, this is what it's upsetting. We're in Utah mm-hmm. taking pics. All right? Nice. I try to f- load more film because I'm like, all right, this roll's done. Reload. Close it. And it just, nothing's going. I'm like, wait, what the hell is supposed to roll the film? Mm-hmm. So what is that called now? I'm on the camera. You man, broke it man. earlier. <laughs> <laughs> and now you realize. Is you picking uh, up the pieces. Man, that, no, I, honestly, that, that one's stressed me Well, you out. got nothing from Utah? I got, I got it. But, like. It was just the last one. That's the oh, last okay, roll okay. to beat. Wow, yeah. I know sometimes whether the roll doesn't work mm. or sometimes you just don't have, you didn't realize you didn't have film. So mm-hmm. the whole day is like, guys. <laughs> or just nothing. And that'd be the batter. Yes, yeah, so the batter yeah, wasn't home. rolling. Oh, fuck, no roll. <laughs> <laughs> niggas just posing up all day for no reason or shit. <laughs> fuck, man. Yeah, I, I had niggas looking stupid sometimes. He's just man. blinking at us. Niggas just. Yeah. <laughs> Bursting a flash on us. Some things are like, yeah, some things are on me and some things are on the camera. <laughs> but I, I I brought it to a man to fix it. He said he couldn't fix it. Mm-hmm. And just I, well, the first day I went to this guy, I said, yo, do you guys get any contacts? This guys get any contacts? Because uh, Ebony was looking for a film camera. So I was like, I'll ask this guy uh, out here. Mm-hmm. Uh, no contacts, no contacts. I break my camera, bring it in. He can't fix it. He's like, yo, I just got a black T3. And I'm like, what? Those are hard to come by. And he said, yo, it's yours if you want it because he didn't even put it up for sale yet. And I said, yo, man. That price. Nah, he, he's, he's blessing me still. I don't want to talk about it. Okay. <laughs> okay. He's blessing me still, but I don't want to talk about it. All right, okay. Nice. Next, next, next. What you gotta do? Right? Give him tree and shit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's he's just saying I can like shoot it, use it, take it, and just he'll put me on a payment plan. Nice. Oh, nice. Stretch it out. It's the same Michael Cat, man. Dog, he's he's an angel. Wow. I like that shit. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah, he works at a little film shop out here in Orlando. Mm-hmm. Um, honestly, I I shout it out. I shout it out. I won't. I won't. Cause it's a small business. If you're in Orlando, um. And you have a film camera, or you have a camera, and he fil- he fixes cameras. Don't go up to them rude ass motherfuckers on yeah. the goddamn colonial and shit, bitch yeah, ass no, niggas, don't man. Go to that nigga, man. Or them bitch ass niggas. Shout them up too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They're so yeah, rude, bro. So rude. They're so They're so rude. rude. I'm sure the other side Every of the single out. time, <laughs> yeah. Stephanie's been in there, and then I've been in there with her, and then she went alone, and then heard from you that they're rude. Oh. I'm like, oh, okay, it's not just us. Mm. Now they're rude and old, man. But this guy Michael at Kiwi Camera Service, sweetheart. Oh. Mm. Fucking sweetheart, sweet stash. Um, they sell film in the background. They sell uh, cameras in the background, not just film cameras, like digital cameras. Um, a couple Super Eight cameras as well. I shot my first Super Eight roll in in Wales. That's I'm excited for that. Oh yeah, what's, um, what's Super Eight? What's that? It's old film, like a little hand cam. So when you're holding the trigger, it's recording onto oh. that film. Um, it does video. It's mm-hmm. a video. Oh wow! It shoots. Got so look. On these nice. cameras, we're shooting right now 50 frames per second, right? We can shoot up to 60 if we needed to. We can go 120. We can go 120 if we needed to. The camera, the Super 8, shoots 16 frames per second. Oh. That's very slow. So that's like. You in the uh, 
You slower than the movie. What's that shit slower. called? The fucking shit. You look into the old toy and you put on your eye and you. The gliderscope or whatever yeah, that shit's called. I think that's yeah. something else, but. Yeah, different yeah, I used way, to love but those. It kind of like you know, this, this is yeah. going like slower anyway. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah. but point is, Kiwi Camera Service. If you Kiwi guys are camera in, service. Uh, yeah. look at this man, man. He's he's, oh, he's legit. Sweetheart. Anybody with a head strap with a light on, mm -hmm. they're already like they're elevated in their yeah, industry. I believe you. Like those barbers yeah. with the headlight. I'm like, yeah. yo, yeah, I kind of <laughs> gotta be messing with hundred dollars. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pay the headlight. Pay right? yeah. You don't have a headlight, you're not charging a hundred bucks. <laughs> You're watching the episode, you're laughing, everything's cool, but you're worried because you don't have no drip and back to school is around the corner. We team up with StockX, man. Y'all know we come with them codes, man. Relax, I'm gonna say the code, man. Let me tell y'all what I got to, to, to bring to the, the table. table. StockX is an online marketplace. Sneakers, apparel, accessories, trading cards, collectibles. They got it. StockX created the most dynamic platform to get all your drip real. Retro Jordans, New Jordans, Nikes, Yeezys, gaming consoles, Legos. You can literally buy three Three blue eyes white dragon cards right now. I've been using StockX literally for years. I remember this one time in grade seven, I bought a pair of Jordan 4 Black Cats for my friend Shaquan. He says, yo, guarantee they're real. Go in front of my friends. I say, yo, check out my new shoes, man. Jordans, man, get with it. They said, where's, where's Jordan? I looked, my, there was no Jumpman logo. That's why I went with StockX because of their verification method. StockX is gonna make sure you are good down to the box. Yo. Trey, I really want these shoes, but I don't know, man. I just feel like only you could pull them off. Express yourself through drips. Yo. Listen, listen, listen. I got a little $15 off, $150 when you shop with the best, man. Shop StockX right now. That's $15 off any order above $150 on StockX.com, man. All you got to do is use the code you see on the screen unless you want me to say it for you. If you do, then here you go. Use the code random order. Yo. You say what's the best sneaker for back to school? Jordan 4 Black Cat, baby, man. Do it right. Don't do it like me. Verify them. Get your drip verified, man. That's $15 off, $150 when you shop on StockX.com using the code random order. Tweet me your fit pics. Yo! You know what's funny? I forgot to say this too, man. Sorry if you're watching. Um, I went to Kiwi the same day I dropped off the camera because it was broken. Uh, I met a fellow eagle in that store. Nice. Oh, and he nice. Said, he said, yo, I love the podcast. I watch the podcast. I shoot film if ever you guys need it. Um, and then he just said, uh, oh, what are you doing here? I'm like, it's my camera shop. He said, it's my camera shop. I said, hey, it's ours now. <laughs> yes. I told him I shot him on the next episode, but we already have recorded episodes and I forgot. But yeah, good local shop. You can't buy the T3, though. I took it. But yeah, he said he's going to bless me with a little payment plan. So I'm like, all right. Because that's the thing, man. I don't want to I don't want to give you the price all up front. Yeah. I'm not... The price he's giving to me, it to me, is still very low than what the other. Like this camera's going for about like thirty five, four thousand online. What? Yeah, it's fucked up still. New topic though. It's the memories, guys. Oh, Everybody gonna memories. be going to him. Yeah. Hey man, yeah. 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 for the low. Search oh, up contacts T three and and the black version is even harder to come by. So he broke perfect camera. Everything runs fine. He said six year warranty. Go back to them and fix whatever they can, like in there, you know. He's he's sick. <gasps> he's sick. They don't make any of the T three, any of the. No man. Oh, these shits are actually three grand. U.S. Yeah, yeah that's like, it's, wild. It's up there. So the price he's giving me and how he's saying I can pay it, I'm like hell yeah, I'll take that off your hands because you're not finding that again. But yeah, that's just what was like. Hell. What was the shit? Because weren't you like watching the prices of those cameras go up? Yeah, Damn, the, when I bought that's... the T two, like it it didn't really hit like that. So mm. it was it was it was just kind of releasing that Kendall Jenner used it, and everyone's uh, like after these yeah. cameras. Yeah, but um, <laughs> yeah, I got put on by a lot of like Charlie Jamal, like a lot of people oh. in Toronto. They had it, and they, they kind of let me shoot with it and like see if I liked it because I was just shooting off of a. Uh, a regular point to shoot like for like five bucks 20 bucks after i bought another one mm -hmm. just off of downtown camera in toronto and then i was like okay i'm seriously investing it and then i bought that one 500 dollars so 600 sorry i was just a steal for the contacts damn yeah and then but they're still selling it for like a rack but then the right now the contacts t2 is about 15 to 2 and then t3 is like i said like three to four and they don't make no more T's? Nah, those are done. They're often that's why when they break, it's like only one man can well, fix oh, it. One less in the world. Yeah, man. It's it's kind of crazy. But they're kinda just such sick. a good camera. I man. wonder if it'll be worth it for them to come back and make film camera. Like that, you yeah, know, continue they, making just 
They Those should. Cameras. They could probably put new tech in it. Yeah, it, they're all know. doing like yeah, like maybe see a screen of what you're. Ta- yeah. I wouldn't want. I think that, there are but, some like that though. Mm-hmm, they do honest. digital ones. Yeah. yeah, Panasonic just made Fuji, one. Fuji does make a, Fuji. a digital film that Fuji has like a is, film yeah. look. Mm-hmm. Fuji gonna do it to you too. Yeah, Fuji, Fuji gonna fool you. Yeah. What? Yeah. Nah, but it's 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 um it's a nice little hobby to get into, honestly. Yeah, I mean, I think yeah, I think photography should be. In everyone's wheelhouse, just take so you can a picture. Get your memories and shit, you know. Take a picture, like, man. You know? Real deal. Yeah, it's the worst when I, I last thing before you jump off film. It's the worst when I give my camera to someone. You have thirty six shots. Anyone that shoots film, you're gonna understand. Oh, like, yeah, they're precious shots. You know, if you're taking three, four, I don't mind it. Depending on what it is, because sometimes you're one shot, you're not gonna get it. But sometimes people don't like they just don't know what it is and they'll be older than us. Mm-hmm. I'm like, bro, you, you guys remember film? Remember? Wait, take one. Kiss, 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 kiss. Oh, my Sorry, bro. guys, ready? All right, I got 34 here. Oh my god. It's doing something. Smoke <laughs> 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 so, <laughs> my roll, nigga. Yeah. Oh this shit was important. God. That's so real. I remember when I, when I went to Costa Rica, there was like six pigs of me on a horse, bro. I don't mm-hmm. need, I just want one, man. Just get the good one, one nigga. Get a, solid, get, a decent, get a decent two. I'm good with that. Oh, man. Yeah, man, but it is what it is, man. Mm-hmm. It's a fun world to get into. Yeah, for sure. You got to have your little yami, man. I'm mm-hmm. not a fan of bringing. We're having hella, you know what I mean? The, the real photographers that have like oh. a bunch of cameras strapped mm. to them. It's like, tsh, yeah. tsh, hold on. Yeah. Tsh, tsh, tsh. yeah. It's just a lot of weight to wield around. I did that so, once psh. at my niece's first birthday. I had a digital camera like this, and then I had a film camera, but a manual one. Yeah. Mm. And I was just like, I remember switching your man, just I busy. Like, yeah, I was like, it's too much. <laughs> I don't feel like a guest it. anymore. Yeah, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I just thought I was working, but you know. <laughs> That's why it, a point and shoot is nice. Oh, point and shoot, psh. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can learn. <laughs> can I see it? Nope. <laughs> yeah, you'll see it later. Yeah, and that's man, the best yeah. part. You just forget about it's it, man. It's true, but. man. Yeah. But I found, like, for me, when I was shooting film, I just, like, I had too much. I took every shot too seriously. So, like, mm-hmm. I would have one role for, like, three months because I'm like, we ain't <laughs> yeah. doing nothing for me to shoot this. Yeah, yeah. you got to forget about it. You have to get into it. that mode of just, but then yes. racking up film and it gets expensive. But you got nah, because this. But them, it, them, yeah. the memories are priceless, man. Yeah, yeah, it's true. Yeah, you be looking at your old baby pictures and shit, and it's like half of it is just in your house fucking around. It's mm-hmm. true. Just yeah. doing nothing. Yeah. Mom sitting on the couch and shit. Yeah. But you say, oh, I remember when I took this picture here and yeah. like, all that. So if anyone in Orlando is going to Kiwi Camera Service, let Michael know that Trey sent you. Just say Trey sent me from from random order. That's it. So the next time I see him, he's gonna say, oh. You're a real nigga. He's white, so he can't say that, but he'll know he'll yeah. think about it. You're a real say it in his head. Good guy. You're a real good guy. Nah, he's a he's a sweet. You're guy. a solid dude. Yeah, straight. Y'all yeah. see him Barbie? Yeah, I checked uh, him out, man. Oh, you watched it? You watch it? Yeah. Uh, okay. Don't spoil it. Don't spoil it, but how'd you feel about it? Nah, it was good. I enjoyed the movie. I'm like, yeah, this is cool. This is a cool concept. I enjoyed yeah. getting into the world and shit and what how is they, the concept? how they built it out. It's a Barbie world. It's a Barbie yeah, you know, world. It's literally like Black yeah, Mirror the, type of thing, but Barbie. Kind of, yeah. So like the Barbies in theory, like have their own world. Mm. Oh. And but they're like they're like tethered to like their like their their actual Barbies in the real world. Um, oh. Being played with like their whatever their owners and shit. Really? So, yeah. So I, it, it. Okay. At first glance, it just seems like the Barbie world stands on its own, but then they're like, oh, there's a whole real world and. Da, 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 da. So basically, in the Barbie world, women rule the world. Right. So you you yeah. recommend? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a fun watch. Yeah, it's a, yeah. It's, a, mm-hmm. it's a it's an event. Nice. Mm-hmm. Ladies I, I, are digging it. It's yeah. a it's a visually appealing movie as well. Right. It's just very bright colors. And it's shit. not yeah. it's not like is it like a pop movie? Like you know what I mean? Like is it what like a mainstream? Do you get mainstream energy from it? Like oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, for okay. sure. You see the big big budget and shit. Yeah. You know, okay. This is a big. But like in a bad way though, like because you know like. What's a, what's an example I can give? Maybe like a Grease. Like you watch Grease. Like I ain't for me. You know. Like, Grease. Oh yeah. Yeah. You know yeah. Like I don't even. Say That's it's a musical for me. though. It is a musical. Yeah. But to me, it just like it's so hot. It feels so Hollywood. Like does it feel Hollywood? Or does it have some soul to it? Yeah, I have some soul. Yeah, so I was surprised. Like I, I thought it was gonna be like some you know cheesy, right. super cheesy shit to laugh at and fuck off. And I'm like, oh, this, I just caught myself laughing and shit. Okay, cool. It was entertaining. 
I ain't, I'm going to catch you at the crib, I'll tell you that. I ain't yeah, yeah, I know. All day. All day. I ain't going to catch you. Y'all got enough bees anyways. Yeah, for real. I'm, I'm going to catch you at the real crib talk. for sure. I still got to see Mermaid. That, yeah, I think that's too, on man. Disney Plus now, though, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to probably Boot watch that. Up. that, that. Dog. Yeah, it was nice, man. They had some nice messages and shit, man. Nice, nice. Felt bad for being a guy and shit. I'm like, oh, fuck, sorry, man. Oh, really? It's one of those, eh? Yeah. Okay. Right. No, but it's, yeah, you know. Yeah. So, you know how sometimes there's no Wi Fi on the plane, right? Mm -hmm. And I was just telling y'all on uh, my flight to to Frankfurt mm -hmm. that I had a bad seat. Mm -hmm. So, I was trying to text Julian. <laughs> I was trying to text Julian, but no Wi Fi on the plane. So, I'm like, all right, if he's on his phone, let me see if he has the airdrop on. Mm -hmm. So, I wrote my notes. My back fucking hurts. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to screenshot it. I tried to like drop it to him, but he was, I guess he was sleeping. How fucking funny that's is that, funny. bro? That's, 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 it's, uh, that's yeah, a smart man. move, man. That's a... Oh, you don't airdrop pics to like send like. I just wouldn't think to do blitz. it on the plane, but that's, mm. that's amazing. That's pretty. Yeah, no, I was trying to tell crafty. him, like, yo, yeah. fuck, turn around, bro. Like, that shit hurts, man. Mm -hmm. At least but, just look at me, you know? It just yeah. makes me feel better. Yeah. Just, <laughs> 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 Okay, oh my god, yeah. Enjoy your enjoy your sandwich. Yeah, man, I think it's living up there. I was almost about to ask him, are you trying to switch? Switch, you know what I'm saying? Do five for five, brother. Yeah. <laughs> oh word, man. Word. Oh my god. And what's up with like US or European countries like Let's stick to one thing. You know what I mean? Like they switch up gas, they switch up miles, they switch up the kilometers and it's only Celsius. the states that switches that shit up. By the way, well, okay, if it's dumb, it's dumb. But I'm in, I'm in, uh, I'm in the first class lounge. Yeah. When I was in the thing, I just my buddy had a pass. I was just his yeah. number one. He said, "Stay close to me." Yeah, <laughs> fucking tackled. <laughs> Y'all don't get too much food. <laughs> I go to get a breakfast. Where our flight was like at, it was an early flight, so they're serving breakfast. And um, if you ever been like any like lounges in the airport they serve food they give you like unlimited drinks it's an open bar you just get what you get but it, there's certain times where you take advantage and certain times where it's like the company's gonna win because it's five in the morning you're not gonna order sh drinks or shots or whatever depend on you know mm. so I, I go and i get this whole plate and our morning's already kind of going a little rocky we had to wake up at 4 a.m take a two-hour drive to birmingham because there's no airport in wales like you gotta drive to either Manchester or fucking um, it's Birmingham, Birmingham. Someone, yeah, yeah, Birmingham or, or Manchester. Um, so it's a two-hour drive there. We finally get there, and I'm tired. Whole ruckus to get my bags checked in and shit. They're doing the whole security scan. Something's going off in my bag. I'm like, all right, whatever. I'm finally here, trying to get some food. Mm. Put some eggs on there. I'm ants, scrambled eggs, whatever. I'll take it. Some glizzies. I did like three breakfast glizzies. Sausage breakfast is. Socks, they may yeah, be the best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Breakfast sausages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all do the maple brown sugar. Yeah, with... oh. <laughs> man, come on. Yo, the way they grill too, it's just they roll, just roll like, bro. Oh my god, dude. I like that golden brown. Yeah, oh, they just turn over man. the dead body. Yeah. <laughs> golden brown. Yep. <Yeah. laughs> you do a slow spin yeah, on that. Like, yeah, like, you fucking, the spatula, yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> you just flatten them out like paper. Three sixty C all yeah. day. Mm. <laughs> Yo, it's good. It's good. I don't even care what part of the cow this is, nigga. I don't give a fuck. Season it with maple, <laughs> nigga. Good. I see a bunch of them laying down just like this. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm going in. I already had eggs on my plate. I put about five of them. I'm not going to yeah. lie to you. I'm in the first well, yeah. class lounge. You know what else is eating these? Five. I'm eating them. I'm doing it. Yeah. Put the whole spatch and just lift yeah. them. Yeah. <laughs> just lift all <laughs> However much the spatch holds. <laughs> then I get some bacon. <laughs> Slap it on top. It looks like a spider nest on my shit. Like it's just a mm -hmm. fucking spider nest, just with hella food caught in it. With web? The wet, yeah. <laughs> oh, <that. laughs> like, I don't have a nest. Cause my shit was so big, it was a nest. <laughs> it was a spider web with shit caught in it. So I'm, I'm there now. I'm, I'm, I'm fucking. <laughs> You understand yeah. me, right? Nah, for sure. The visual, the visual yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. For sure. <laughs> so, I'm here. I'm here. My plate is made. The only thing left to get is ketchup, mm. right? 
Oh, boy. I'm, I'm, in, I'm in. I'm in Manchester or whatever. I don't. I don't even want to make this a claim because I don't know if y'all do that. Mm. I get and I see it. They're serving ketchup with a spoon. Mm. What the fuck? They're serving ketchup. Whatever. I'm asking. In my case, it helps me source my nuts. This is confirmed ketchup, or it just looks like ketchup. So that's that's that's. <laughs> Go to, I go to sit down, fucking ant, bro. Have had to <laughs> add one episode one forty three just dropped. Oh yeah, prop that up. I'm fucking doing my headphones, noise cancellation. I say Yo, it's time to tune in. It's time to wild and out. Go in, <laughs> bro. I take a bite, dog. First off, it's fucking salsa. Uh, 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 <laughs> Who the fuck eats salsa with breakfast? Like Mex, like salsa, like tomatoes, salsa, like salsa, like tostito yeah, salsa, yeah, yeah, tostito yeah, yeah, yeah. salsa. Yeah, 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 yeah. I say, all right, budget, you're trying to <laughs> fuck with me. I scrape <laughs> it off. I lose three baking strips in the process. No I was, way, I was no pissed. Way, no way. I was pissed. Even though I can go and get more, I yeah. lose about three. <laughs> Take it off. Well, I can slap it on the napkin. I said, at least I still got my eggs, man. No ketchup. Nice. Go in for my eggs. I eat it. I'm like, why does it taste like dust? <laughs> the eggs. Bro, so you know you know the the Santa fucking egg mix. Yeah, you gotta search it up. It's a Santa. Really? It's powdered eggs. That's yeah, what yeah, it's yeah, powdered bro. eggs. With the army cats and shit. Yeah, I said, bro, am I going to the moon? <laughs> Fine. So scrambled. You just scrambled eggs. Scrambled dust. Oh my god. I scraped the fucking eggs off. Oh, yeah, yeah, I said no. I see I'll get to where Julian's at. He's like <laughs> in the lounge. <laughs> Scrap the eggs off my plate. All that stuff is my trusty glizzies, man. Oh, like, yeah. These these never let me down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I bite a glizzy. I I promise. You, I promise. You, I promise. You, you know me. I would have ate it. Put it down. Scrape the glizzies off my plate. Fuck. Everything is it's bad. Huh? Bad. Inedible. Dusty Damn. foot dog. I ain't never heard eggs described as dust. I ain't gonna lie. It's Dusty eggs. powdered eggs, bro. I was that's like so a, that's a, like, pissed. That's an actual thing. Is what you're saying? I hundred. It, it was powder. I could taste the dust. Powdered eggs. Man. This is the first class lounge. This is the first class lounge. This is how they treat. This is how they treated me. <laughs> <laughs> so you know, bro. <laughs> I've never. The sausage tasted like. Honestly, like I don't even know, man. Like it's like you pierce through the skin and then the the sausage fell out. Ew. Mm. I didn't you even know how to. Nah. Oh man. yeah, this is a thing. It's a thing. Powdered eggs. You don't do that there. Powdered eggs, yeah. Yeah, real deal. But I guess in Europe they just get down different, man. I don't know. Maybe I missed the ketchup, but a sauce on my bacon and eggs, man. I was, I was fuming, man. I just had to drink tea. Military powdered ed- eggs. Yeah. You don't. But do they that. have eggs. They they, they have, have eggs. it. <laughs> I'm like, like they have no like they're in space, bro. I was furious, man. Because morning time, you know, you just want to eat. That's the only thing setting your day right. Mm-hmm. A good meal. Before yeah, before I hop on this bird, man, get yeah. me right. Sorry, yeah, bro, I guess it gets sketchy man. sometimes, man. Yeah. And this is before your flight to where? Portugal. Yeah, going to Lisbon. But serious, man. Fuck, man. Yeah. Fuck me up. Yeah. And the thing was, I think this is karma. Because we, have, okay, so there's one guy that we're rolling with named Thomas, man. Shout out to Thomas who watches the podcast. He said we'd be having them die, man. Shout yeah, out yeah, to T Dog. T Dog. I mean, T Dog or something. Yeah. Okay. So we get in the lounge and he's saying, I have access. And I said, No way. He says, I only have access to bring one of y'all. There's two of us. Okay. Mm. So I look at Julian and I'm saying, All right, like, go in. And we'll see the season when we get there. Say, yeah. Tell me if it's nice and if it is, bring out a plate. I wasn't tripping about going in bring there. Bring out a plate. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm going to trip. You don't bring out a plate. Because we have our story about Waleed when he yeah. got global access. Yeah, no sharing with him. No man. sharing. So anyways, uh, we get there and then she's like, oh, uh, you can only bring one guy into your pass. And if you want to buy an additional pass, it's $20 for that other guy to get in. But I'm not trying to sit in the airport, everyone coughing and shit. Our flight was like two hours, like... You try to sit 20. on the couch, eat yeah. some food. So I'm like, bro, $20? I'm like, yeah. June's like, nah, 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 nah. Starts walking away. I'm like, you just take the free pass. I'll pay the $20 and, or 20 pounds and get into the lounge and chill. Mm-hmm. He's like, nah, 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 nah. But sometimes, like, I don't know what it is. Once one person says, fuck this, I feel like it changes Contagious. something in, like. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Mm-hmm. It changes. Like, he, the eggs became powdered when he said, fuck this and walked away. Oh. If he said, nah, like, yeah, I'm down, let's do it. 
I maybe would have enjoyed the eggs a little oh, bit more. Interesting. You know what I mean? Interesting. That nigga would hate them. That nigga would hate them. That would ruin it. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, he said he said forget it. He's gonna wait, and, and, and he ended up having a better time than us, man. But. Yeah, I would have just yeah. paid a store for that shit, man. Downstairs mm-hmm. in the normal lounge. Yeah, I still would have. I still would have paid to get in there because it was just chilling for an hour. Got to charge my shit, yeah. get some coffee, mm-hmm. get some Wi Fi, spread gotta, this shit out. They gotta, they gotta add some things to airports, man. Yeah, I'm, you know, like I don't want to get my shoes shined. That's old. Yeah, that's old. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. That's like for the yep, horse. And if I have a yeah. two, three hour layover, like, bro, that's twenty minutes. The last thing yeah. I'm going to ever do, nigga, let me go fucking polish my shoes. Yeah. I'm probably yeah. wearing Crocs or something. Like, what the fuck? Like, niggas are in the airport with hard bottoms on? Maybe yeah, flying no. for like a bit for a meeting and shit. Okay, if you're going for the fresh off the jet thinking. to the meeting. Fresh off the jet, yeah. That's but I'm at the table, thing, nigga. I'm not fucking standing on stage. Just mm-hmm. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. But, nigga, bring your, but shoes. Where's your shiny yeah, shoes. Like, Put yo, in the shiny shoe bag. Where's the arcade? Is this the at, mall? Man? Where's the mall? Yeah, there's some. It's like, kind of like a mini mall. In there, but here in, in Orlando, the mall here is fucking goon trying to say, hey, nice shoes, bro. Come here. Let me show you what I, my solution. Oh, that's the other shiny yeah, shoes. Like, nigga, <laughs> stop, man. <laughs> 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 my, solution, my solution go crazy. I'm like, bro, I don't care. <laughs> but they, yeah, they need to fix it. Cause, and again, in Frankfurt, I was tired. We had a five hour. They got like, a five hour airport? Hmm? Do you mean any airports? They have showers? I bet they would, yeah. Singapore, yeah. Singapore, Singapore huh? Yeah, no, nah, you're gonna get the shit, miss your flight. <laughs> but they're gonna put the shower with the, with the, with the True, with the true, true. But in, in Germany, they had these pods, and you basically rent it out, sleep there for however long you want. Mm. And then they change the, you've seen where the laundry was, where they swap it out, and you can go shower there. But I was, I told Drew, I'm like, bro, it's now or never we made this decision, because I'll go into this pod and lock. Close the blind, you're in there sleeping. Crawling. It's like a bed pod. It was like a door. Like it was the room was probably maybe half a quarter of this room. Mm-hmm. Like just a sliver, but long ways. Just enough so for just a human. Enough, just enough for a bed, some bags, and and for you like uh there's no toilet in there. You have to go somewhere else. But yeah. it's just that. I'm like, bro, that's how you airport. Yeah. Real deal. As you tighten up your bootstraps for this busy coming fall season, you might be thinking of fast, wholesome, convenient meals to supply the fuel you need. Factor is America's number one ready-to-eat meal kit, and they can help you do just that with nutritious, ready-to-eat meals delivered straight to your door. It's quick. We're talking two minutes. It's healthy. Dietitian approved. Your dietitian might give you a hug. And it's tasty. Meet you on the shelf and have to take a private meeting to agree. Guys, the food is good. My personal champion so far is still that tomato goat cheese cavatappi primavera, but it got all sorts of good stuff. So treat yourself to over 34 weekly tasty meal options creamy parmesan chicken you like that stuffed pepper casserole maybe that's your steez there's also an assortment of over 45 add-ons if you want to replenish your snack supply we're talking coconut pancakes smoky bacon and cheddar egg bites already in just two minutes this fall get factor and enjoy healthy eating without the hassle simply choose your meals and enjoy fresh never frozen flavor packed meals straight to your doorstep ready in just two minutes no prep no mess maybe you gotta wash a fork i'll wash a fork why don't you head on down to factormeals.com slash random order five zero and use the code random order five zero for fifty percent off Fitness. that's code random order five zero at factormills.com slash random order five zero for fifty percent off save it yeah i feel like chairs could be better too for everyone man mm-hmm. so the first class lounge you know what i mean mm-hmm. they'd be giving them niggas the hard ass chairs and mm-hmm. shit stop being so cheap man you just makes everyone miserable in the mm-hmm. airport and shit no wonder everyone's so fucking miserable mm-hmm. Like, I agree. All right, if you want to go pay for whatever, like, the lounge access and you're getting food and shit, all right, cool. You can't get free food off for everyone. All right. Yeah. You guys want to pay for that, pay for that. But yeah. have a cool, chill spot. New airports are doing that, though. I got to give them credit. Yeah, they got mm-hmm. the P5s in Paris. Where is the that? who? P5s. What's the PS5s? PS5s? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was, like, some shoes. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> that was P5s a couch. in Paris. <laughs> Paris yeah. Airport, they have those. So. so I feel like shit like that. It don't gotta be video games. It could just be like, maybe like a little movie theater. Just some love, like something you know, something that you show know? some love. That's yeah. it. Yeah, show some love. So show some damn respect. Yeah, real deal. Oh, I thought y'all was waiting for y'all to <laughs> support me there. I was like, yeah, that's <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, that's what it boils down to. Still, why do they upcharge things? Like what? Does it make money? Mm. But damn. And niggas gonna do there. it. Like it's niggas in here already. Yeah. They want more. You know how many people are <laughs> trying to milk. That's what I'm saying, but like, yo, when Wendy's could be the same here. 
as it is outside, and you would still make money. Yeah, they make but, money outside, <laughs> but they're like, I, it's, yeah, you they know how we make more. Yeah. <laughs> nah. It's also a little bit. It's a. Uh, you gotta understand, man. When you're working at it. the airport, you gotta always go through security. You gotta no pay the people a little bit more because it's like, yo, you're working. At, everyone has to go through security. Imagine going to the airport as your work. Uh-huh. It's busy, parking's fucked. Like you'd have to pay me more to work at the airport. So what are you saying? I don't know. What are you saying specifically about? I think they're boosting up their prices because, like, to get the shit in there, truck deliveries and everything, to get the all the equipment in there, it's like everything is going to be a little bit more because more security, mm. more secure. Like, I mean, they probably got their airport tax to pay in the ter- yeah. in the terminal. They yeah, they probably got to yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't think of that too. Airport said it, we gonna need something, nigga. So they're like, all right, guys, seventeen dollars mm-hmm. sandwich. Mm. Yeah. yeah, I thought they offset it. I guess <laughs> I thought it was because you know mm. you got to go through it because the gate, the t- the food in the terminals and in the actual like gate areas and all that, you're gonna have to you got to go through shit to get there. You can't just get there. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Mm-hmm. That's what I was kind of thinking. But yeah, maybe they're just paying tax to the airport to say, "Oh, I'm selling my shit here." Uh-huh. Expenses and making more bread. Hmm. Oh. Crazy, crazy. <laughs> I want to say Chick Fil A was kind of like the same price, and it was, was in the A or one of the airports. <clears throat> really, my shit was the same in Terminal. Man, three. it's always a blessing to see that red chicken when you <laughs> land at a it's true, mysterious it's airport. True, it's true. It's true. That damn red chicken. Yeah, they got it in the new section of the of MCO. They got Chick Fil A. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. I got a little breakfast that day. I left. Yeah. Oh, you left from term- yeah, you did. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bruh, yeah that bruh. airport. Bruh. Is- yeah, 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 yeah. They need to do yeah, that to yeah. Terminal A and B. MCO, yeah. get rid of that. Get on it, man. Strip the carpet, man. Rip that Rip. fucking carpet off the ground, bro. It's <laughs> time. Rip it out. Rip man. it. I hate low carpet. Like if you're gonna be carpet, at least have some like this is good. Mm. I'll take this because I-, I you can keep me warm. The carpet mm. where it's just low, but it's like hardwood. I'm like dog. What? Hardwood, yeah. That's what MCO has going on there, man. It's just like. But I wonder how, like, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it would affect them a lot financially to like, because you got to stop the airport, right? Like. That's what you're saying. Yeah, but you if you read the, yeah, I don't know. I'm not go to airport, Terminal yeah. Three for now. But how many planes can fly out of there, type of thing? Yeah. They can do a little section by. All right, don't look yeah. over here. All right, cool. Yeah. Don't look over here. Yeah. Right, don't yeah. look. Y'all go about your business. Yeah. Yeah. It's so crazy how that time just. Came and passed. Yovid? Yeah. Yeah. What a goddamn time. Where is it, you know? Yeah. It was I don't even want to be that type of podcast, a conspiracy podcast. <laughs> You're talking about aliens, like, bro. We're there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they confirmed it now. They confirmed yeah, it, man. They did. Which is nuts. Yeah. I don't even know what and who to believe until I see it. They, you know I mean, they could do all the press conferences mm-hmm. and shit and all the trials and shit. Show me <laughs> yeah. 4K. Uh-huh. This is the, you know what I mean? We're talking about fucking big, big budget yeah. agencies and, you know what I mean? Organizations talking yeah. about the communications and interactions with aliens. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. All this yapping. Mm-hmm. Show me. Aliens should have been in a zoo. <clears throat> you ask me. <laughs> no, that's bro, show me a pit. That's show me up. a pit. I'm just saying. Animals shouldn't even be in the zoo. They shouldn't, but they there. So show me a video. Put the motherfucker in there. Let me go pay nah. my little 49, 50, whatever, and go see that. It's all a show Behind to you. Huh? <laughs> Humans are fucked, man. I'm like that's what look. Put it in a cage so I can see it. Yeah. <laughs> Same time I agree with you. I gotta you, be safe. I gotta be safe. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the only thing is like I could I we can get away with it. Cause they put they don't put us in cages. In the cages they don't put us in those shackles, in the, man. Uh, Pawn man, it's mm-hmm. it's crazy, man. But yeah, we need to put cats in shackles, man, for this shit right here, man. Oh my god, that's the type of reason I don't shackles. Fuck is with cats crazy too. Look, normal day, moving the fridge. Cat started acting up. Look, it's on you for no reason. I'm kicking him. Hey, no hey. Funny. You know it's all nails, all nails. Mm. Oh my god, mm. he quick with it though. Uh-huh, uh-huh. He's dancing, food dancing. <laughs> Don't drop a bucket on it, like. Where she comes there with nigga? Yo, cats are mysterious, man. Holy, fuck. look at that! Nah, I don't like that, bro. And if you look at that, oh bro, bro, you don't you want do? a cat to be mad at you, bro. I'm going outside. That's your house now, bro. 
That's your crib, fam. Hold that down, dude. Yo, scarier than the dog, man. Honestly, no, 100%. You got to give the cat away. I bet he raised her up. <clears throat> yeah, that's it, bro. But you got to get the cat to give the cat. So mm. I don't even have the balls to pick it up to give it. It really so. makes no sense. Like, was he like fucking. Yo, cats, I've seen cats just snap, snap and just I change see, yeah. and just like, yo, just mm-hmm. no apparent reason, just looking at you different. What? <laughs> <laughs> nah, his energy off, man. That's that's what it, but cat is, you got to think about what a cat is, man. Tell me. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> nah, it's. Uh, so what? A beast. A tiger? It's just it's it's supposed to be outside, man. Like we're not supposed to be living. With, what do you call it when you live with a domesticated um, domesticated animal? Yeah. Not supposed to be fucking with them. I agree. Like a dog, really and truly, can be and is. I think it's just been long like, enough that mm-hmm. it's just like All right, I'll rock with y'all. That's what it was. Or Cats. Just, it was brand new, right? Where were we looking this? Yeah, up? we did. We literally in other yeah in other in podcasts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Cats like forty five. I think dogs have been around longer. Bro. Cats been haven't been. So uh, this is Zootopia effect, man. They're just tweaking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give them a few other hundred fucking thousands of years. Maybe they'll stop scratching us up and shit. Yeah, no, nah, that's crazy. Man. I wonder if his legs are done up. like. Oh, guys. man. Yeah, scratch up. Yeah. Shaved off. Scratch up. Question. Kind of weird. But you guys lotion your back? I don't know. If I can. <laughs> I thought of the times I did lotion my back. I'm like, wow, I I can't lie, bro. It's a wild, inconvenient thing to do. But yo, yo, you gotta do it, man. Like, yo, I can't see it. I don't even know what's going on, man. I feel you, man. But I don't know, man. I'm just like, I just like. Just watching my girl, like she loses her whole body, like yeah, they be coming out shiny. They do everything, and I'm like. Yeah, I need to get like that. Like, I need to, I need to get <laughs> on that level. You feel me? Because I know I'm might be walking around with an you back, <laughs> scaly back. <laughs> you feel me? Yeah, yeah, you can't be sheened yeah. up and then you got mat on your back. <laughs> <laughs> Just see all the finger, the finger traces where you couldn't reach no more. I don't even. Yo, I don't even look at my back. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's crazy to say, but I don't look at my back of like course, that. No, it's not crazy because it's it's your back. Like, you know, it's not a you're not an exorcist thing. Yeah. <laughs> you, know <what> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, but nah, like I really was like, you know, like past couple weeks just deliberately like getting it, man, doing what I gotta do, finding new techniques to get my back. My girl's around, bro. Hit this spot for me. Like, yeah. it's important, man. You got to lotion your back, fellas. I, you know, I wash my back. <laughs> yeah. For sure, yeah. I, put the, I, get, I, got, I got the, the little loofah. brush. Yeah. yeah. You got the reach. Oh, you yeah. got that. I got a long loofah for second hitting him like oh, that. Oh, yeah. I got that, too. The uh, the African. Yes. Yeah, shit is hard, man. What Africa got to do with African that? African sponge. It's like an African it's wash spongy. cloth or something like yeah. that. I think Antibacterial. It's like, yeah, shit. it's nice, man. It's like, yeah. imagine a loofah, but just a long piece of... You can feel it scraping it's the skin it. off of shit. It's oh, nice. Yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. like a dead thing. skin. Nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and I just let the water hit my back and I'm washed. Damn. You gonna be getting them bump, back bumps? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nah. Because you get them back bumps. I just do. You know when you, you gotta reach something on top of a fridge but you can't quite get it so you just like yeah, you know what yeah, I mean. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. that's what I do with my back. Like I mm-hmm. go as far as I can go, and then well, but you could really watch. get it if you like switch hands and shit. Like you I can do that together. Well, yeah, with some yeah. arm teamwork. Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. Good, but yeah. there's still gonna be like I'm probably missing. Like my spine's probably dirty. Yeah, no, yeah. Oh, like it's, <laughs> it's gonna be yeah. like a no man's land. <laughs> yeah, like, like, no matter what. <laughs> nah, or you just this. <laughs> 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 yeah, Bro, I remember when I was. Part, I remember when I was younger. I used to. I never understood like how to dry my back, so I would just get out and like. My back would be wet. For the shirt. <laughs> <laughs> like a yeah. turtle, nigga. Like, just just still fuck it. And like, yeah. fuck it. You know what I'm saying? That my, my older brother showed me, like, the, the, the one oh, of those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's how I started drawing. Yeah. I said, oh, if I just. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, go next, <laughs> you can't go too crazy. That's when it starts to burn. Yeah. <laughs> like, fuck up your back. But, uh, that, was, that, was, that was my first life hack that I ever learned, man. Damn. Yeah. yeah. Damn. Yeah. Shout out to Bro for yeah, that, man. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, that's real. Yeah, it's very, it's a very manly thing to just throw in a fucking shirt and you have wet splotches on your back. 
Yeah. Like, oh, babe, what are you doing for dinner? Like, oh, nigga, drying your back off. Right. Like, are like you sweating mess, already? Bro. Oh, sorry, too. Sorry, sorry. You just yeah. look like a mess, man. Like I did. I got I got back pimples off that though. Like not dry. Or like they're called water pimples or something like that. Oh, really? When you don't dry right. your back properly, look them up. It's like a. It's like like almost like whiteheads. I, I don't even say. know if I want to look at that. I'm taking you up on water pimples. <laughs> I try to change it. Try to go a little further. I think it's called a pimple or something <laughs> like that. Search water back. No nope, water pimple on. <laughs> Back. You gotta all say right, on right. back. Oh, these shits. This is a blister. It's not a pimple. Nah, look at that. Vasilis are. <laughs> Yo, man, this shit is disgust. Ah, oh, no, I can't look at. I can't look. No, it's not a blister. It's called a bula. No, Ooh. just just say it's not that. Just say um. Just say if you don't dry your back properly. Okay, well now I'm gonna get down. So no, I'm that's for... <laughs> <laughs> no, but you're gonna see the pimples that I got. You said water pimple. <laughs> <laughs> just say back me. Just say back, back me. Back me. <laughs> Back knee is you know, crazy. Back knee, yeah. yeah, yeah. Back, Just say not drying back yeah. when you're out of the shower. Okay, damp back bumps. <laughs> <laughs> that would that would do. Sometimes I get small. Why am I getting small bumps on my back? Okay, let's see. What happens <laughs> if you don't dry your back? When don't dry back? Back wet. <laughs> yes, I think that's a racial. The dry air evaporates the water from your body and it cools it. Yeah. You go to pit, go to images. <laughs> yeah, what happened? Show me what happened. Oh, that's what it is. If you like that, I'd get those. So it's almost like back knee, yeah. Yeah, it's like I think that is back knee to be honest. Yeah. So yeah. when I wasn't drying my shit properly, it was it was like that. My back is nice now though. My back is good. Smooth back? Yeah. I'm nice. pretty smooth back. I wouldn't want you have hair on your back? Man, it's like the fine. Uh, it seems like the it's laying down the groundwork for right now? a hairy future. Yeah. Fuck, man. I'm sorry, bro. Who needs hair on the back? Yeah, if I can't dry my back, I'm definitely not shaving my back. Yeah, cause we're monkeys, man. That's it. That's all it is. And that's why sometimes I just want to tap in with my monkey side. <laughs> cause, bro, I went to go get a haircut and. Obviously, we have beards, but my hair was growing up to my cheeks because mm. I just like I wasn't even lining it up because to go full beast when you get a haircut, you know, give the barber more hair to like shape your beard. Mm-hmm. Mm. So I just went beast mode and he's like, yo, your hair is growing to your eyes, but also my eyebrows are growing down. Oh my God. And my hair is, he's like, yo, you have a hairy face. And I was like, hmm. <laughs> it like just tapped in. Like you just went full mode. Like, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm rip. You said I'm Ripley's boys. Fucking real wolf, man. I'm Jesus. telling you, bro. If I move to Alaska, I'm going beast mode. Ripley's hairy guy. Remember this cat? I do remember that guy. Hair man. <laughs> real no, rap, man. No, shit. Man. Shit's legit. His name is Hair Man. I'm nah. telling you. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That was cat, right? <laughs> <laughs> nah, Larry Gomez, man. That's hair on his face. Yeah, that's not a tat, too. No, no, no. I, I, I oh, remember. Yeah. Nah. Yeah, honestly, this would be a nightmare for me. Still. Yeah. yeah. That's racist. No, it's called Wolfman. No, it's it's racist. What? Doing blackface. Is he doing hair face? Nah. See how easy it is to get canceled. Nah. He. Nah. I wouldn't smoke with him. Cause I'd be scared. It's in the lineage, man. Primates mm. and shit, man. Yeah. <sighs> Lineage of thumb havers. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. It's actually crazy. I say it a lot. Also, when I was in Wales, I kept dropping that. I'm like, damn, that's crazy. What, is everything okay? Like, oh, yeah, no, it's just the chicken's fire. What? Oh, the chicken is good. <sighs> that shit was, that shit was, one part was weird. We're, we're on the menu. We're looking at the menu, sorry, and uh, there's like some lamb shanks. And mm. she comes over and she said, the waiter says, uh, Oh yeah, the lamb shanks are really good. Like, they're, like they're super fresh. Like mm. they came in this morning. But there's so much farmland for real. So mm. the sheep literally just get slaughtered. I'm like, yo. In a weird way, I almost didn't want to order it because I'm seeing all these sheep around and goats. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, nice, cute. You know those? Uh, you ever eat like a full shrimp? No, yeah. only in halves. Mm. Why not? What do you mean? What? Because <laughs> who doesn't eat a full shrimp? <laughs> nah, but like, you know what I'm talking about. The right? like, the yeah, whole the joint. Head, oh, everything oh, is yeah, yeah, I yeah. just feel weird with them joints. Like, all oh, like to pick him apart and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see the face and shit. Like, <laughs> the face yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. crazy. Like, yeah. Yeah, for I, a while, I remember like not knowing. Mm-hmm. Like it was obviously this is a kid still, but like not knowing what a shrimp was in full. Like mm. I knew what a shrimp was. It was just like a, a thing that a handle yeah. and a yeah. fucking curl. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then I saw a real shrimp. I'm like, oh, that's how it starts. And, and the fact that a yeah. shrimp doesn't start off pink, it just 
threw me off for a little yeah. bit. I saw live shrimp just gray and translucent and shit. And that's that's what I was saying the other day, man. It's like these animals really, uh, it's it's unfortunate they don't know what happens when we put them to the fire. Not to mention yeah. a little bit of season. A little bit, yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, you, I'm excited about you. Yeah, Trust you know, me, mean, pepper mm-hmm. shrimp. Yeah. Like, you have to That'd be an honor. Yeah. Mm-hmm. If, I'm, if I'm a shrimp, I'm going to go out. I better mm-hmm. be in a bag of pepper shrimp. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> At least. Sometimes when these rappers are talking about packs. Yeah. I'm talking about smoking on packs, so I always I'll be on there. Apparently, Tupac told his boys Ooh. to smoke them. I wonder what yeah, the hell I'm that with, was I'm about. With, yeah. Honestly, I'm with cremation, so y'all can smoke me for sure. You, I don't need nah. to go in your lungs. Yeah, I don't need, you don't need to do that. <laughs> your blood, your yeah. blood streaming, that's a lot to yeah. ask. If you're into that. You know, the yeah. thing is that's into that, I would be honored. Is that really a thing? That is a thing. Yeah, yeah. To, to smoke thing. someone? To smoke yeah. someone's ashes. And then you get a Why? piece of them. You get a, you get a random fact about them. Yeah, No. You what? Didn't hear that? You got a random attribute about them. No, this nigga watching How High or something. <laughs> <laughs> Just wake up and hoop. Say, hey, man. Smoke my nigga. Yeah. <laughs> No, yeah, it's like it's like sprinkling me. your fucking ashes in the ocean or something. Right? Yeah, do different. that. That's not on my neck. No, nah, it's the same shit, bro. You put me in the air though. But it's in your well, body I'm first. It. I'm inhaling. You're just blowing you know. blow out the right waste. But what if I accidentally inhale? Like you're saying, do you like a cigar? Yeah. But I'm saying, what if like I just accidentally inhale? Well, I mean, okay. I think the but side he of put, it. He said, put him in a blunt. Yeah, so he's, he's saying, it, like, yeah, yeah, if you're rolling, if you're smoking mm-hmm. weed, you're going. Inhale. But you're not. You're but not, Tupac's so mysterious. You're just holding it. You might put it, but you it come out. But you hold it so it could bond to the, you know, what I mean, to mm-hmm. your lungs and then get in the bloodstream and shit. And the rest is just like, all right, I can't do nothing with this. <sighs> Mm. You get high and shit, and then I don't know what type of effects ashes has on. I feel like you start having bad dreams and shit. Are good dreams, you know? Why you smoking? Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! I'm gonna be quit, man. Like, I'm good. Yeah, you heard about Jeezy. He said he got paranoid one time when he smoked. He said he was listening to he was listening to some song. He felt like the song was chasing him. When he was high one time. And the he, song was He didn't him? smoke for 10 years. The yeah. song was chasing him? That's what he said. Like the beat? Yeah. He said the beat was chasing him. Tupac asked his boys to smoke him. It was the outlaws. This is real? Yeah. It's in his song. Um, It's in his song, Black Jesus. He rhymes, we die clutching glasses filled with liquor bombastic cremated last wishes. My niggas smoke my ashes. Smoke me, man. I need to do a Google quick, man. <laughs> Should I smoke? Just sprinkle a little bit of me in there. Don't do like a whole joint of just me, though. That's kind of weird. He said the conversation was a very real conversation. This is Outlaws member and Tupac when he was alive. He was giving us some history on where it came from, what he learned about it, why he thought it was something interesting. Wouldn't it be some shit if one of us died just so we can always be a part of each other if we did that? Wouldn't that be something? Shit you talk about while you're young and high. So it's just Tupac just had an idea? A high thought? Yeah. Like, okay, yeah, please. Beat it. Snorting. Cre- well, snorting? When did we yeah. get to that? Yeah, I ain't snorting. Don't snort. Can though. I snort my friend's ashes? <laughs> Let him go. <laughs> Yeah. Let him go. <laughs> it's over, bro. You ain't taking enough pics, man. Well, you think- <laughs> Come on, one last moment, nigga. <laughs> yeah, you gonna join him if anything? Yeah, that's wild. That's wild. Ooh. You know, I wouldn't. I wouldn't yeah. even like. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna leave a quest for niggas to go do something to me after I'm gone. Like, go spread me in Iceland. Yeah. Music, Fuck bro. my Iceland. I was wanting to go to Iceland. This was <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Spread me on the that. The Arctic. Bro, I'm putting you at your Disney Park. Oh, I'd haunt you. I'd haunt you. Because imagine you, that's just where the spirit is just, that's where you are for the rest of your life. Fucking Chinkoozie. Hearing damn sheep feed and shit. Oh, man. Oh, Chinkoozie Park is a little uh, Brampton gem. It's a little. Yeah. Is it still a petting farm? Yeah, I think so. It's like a petting farm, little grounds and shit and lakes and stuff. I remember the first time I smelled a barn. Not pleasant. Yeah, and it was probably Chinkuzi Park where I'm like, yo, bro. Sometimes like it, I, with the right, right amount, right amount. Sometimes like manure, not yeah. does it smell good, yeah, but yeah, just yeah, like, yeah. Just, hey, hold on, let me. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's just like ah, mm. farm. Yeah, I'm farm. yeah. Like I can understand a yeah. farmer. I could type in, yeah. tap really? into the thank you. Yeah. Well, sometimes it smells like yo. This smells like legit straight shit, shit. and that's yeah. like too far. Like the but manure. Like, go ahead. You know what I mean? The manure to help the grass grow type shit. There's sometimes, different types. Yeah, I think there's different types. So sometimes it's like you saying sometimes it smells. Like I want to crack my window, but like, okay, ah. okay, okay, yeah. okay. But I'm like, all right, all right, all right, all right. 
Yeah, we're on farm. Yeah. Mm. Or maybe it brings you back to Jacuzzi Park. <laughs> yeah. There's certain types of manure because they use manure to to help uh, plants grow and yeah, crops yeah, grow and all yeah. that. So, but it's just if it's just straight cow action. Oh no no yeah. But I'm, I'm, no. isn't it straight cow action? No, nah, because they'll mix some other things in there. Like what? Let me see. What is manure exactly? Yeah. Manure ingredients. I'm gonna start saying that, man. I gotta, I gotta go manure, brother. <laughs> Manure ingredients? Yeah, see? Additional water. <laughs> <laughs> Shit and water. Animal feces in yeah, urine. Right, That's duh. what it says, bro. Yeah, yeah no. I get what he's saying. I'm just, yeah. I'm like, what else, man? Because there's a certain type. It's just like yeah. manure light. Like, diet manure. manure. Light. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you know you're driving, an orange, you're driving an orange yeah. and it's just like, mm, like you know yeah <laughs> like new. farmland ah. but you probably smelling like maybe some flowers maybe some plants they say that there it is there it is y'all okay. help, there, me there, there, help me there help me there help me there I'm really trying to help them get out of the hole I'm like come on man <laughs> shit smell good nigga with the right angle <laughs> nah get what you're saying man say when you go to smaller ocean no, but I don't like a fishy ocean. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say that's why I don't like. Sometimes you get a. Sometimes you just buy a fishy shrimp. What the fuck is this? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Like, I feel bad bringing you know throwing the shrimp in the garbage. And nah, shit, a but. seagull will pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> that's real rap, man. Circle of life. Yeah, circle of this eye. <laughs> yeah. <Man. sighs> I feel like I could chat all day, man. But this, yeah, you know sure, what I mean. Sure. How long has it been? Bruh, bruh. I'm 13. Put a beat on. Put a beat on. Spiritual rap, man. Spiritual rap, man. Yeah, spiritual rap, man. It's going to get some. Years ago, I... <laughs> oh, this <laughs> live. <laughs> Let me get on the royalty free, man. See what we got. Yeah. I need keywords, man. Keywords. Search Farm. Nah, that's going to give us a terrible beat. Search up. It got to be hip hop. Hip hop. Hip hop dark. Hip hop angry. Hip hop. Nice. Trap is always bad. Trap is always Rose terrible. Rosie Trap is the worst. Yeah. Honestly, whatever comes. Word. Oh, here we go. It's a little fast. Nah, this is right, fast know what? as fuck. That's 95. Okay, 85 yeah, BPM. 85. In yeah. that lo-fi. By yeah. Water Mellow. Nah, this is going to be too slow. Yeah, I hate that shit. Driving hip hop. Driving hip hop? It don't even matter what this is. Sean, give me a word. Manure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, bro. Come on. Imagine swaying in the morning. You just ain't going through me. Come on, bro. Yeah, close the door on that one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Heather B's not going to do it. Come on, give me something else. Luxury man. brand hip hop. Yo. It's crazy the way I feel sometimes, like manure. <laughs> like they don't even want me no more, man. Just a I load just of pussy <laughs> shit, man. <laughs> just a hunk of shit, man. <laughs> All right. I don't know, man. I was about to boom back positive. Oh, you was boom back. That? Oh yeah, there yeah, it is. Yeah, that, that was my intro. Boom back positive. Always yeah. gonna do it too. Yeah. Sometimes I just feel like <laughs> hey, opposite of manure. <laughs> I feel good. <laughs> Yo, owl, owl, yeah. I thought it was you that said owl. Nah, 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 nah. Give me something else, man. This ain't working, Sway. This ain't working, man. All right. I gotta get a fifteen off at that least. Goddamn Walmart man. commercial beat. Yeah, All right, right, man. Uh, give me trendy hip hop. Go ahead. Oh, that's oh. by Loops Lab. Look, oh, yo, fuck, I know this one. It's kind of, yeah, it's too much stuff. Crazy? Yeah. <laughs> I was ready. I was ready. Sweet. All right, look. turn that one himself. It's too, if, it's too I, much. Okay, this is, I'm on Sway in the morning. And he's saying, listen, you ain't leaving until I hear a hot six. Really? All right, this one's called Hip Hop. Yeah, give it to me. 99 instrumentals. Oh, yeah. Oh, straight spaz. Oh, yeah, Sway. Sway in the morning. Them hyenas. Come on, bro. <laughs> Sway, I can't get down with this, man. Why are all these fucking... This is right. Jazz Future Chill. Give me that. You Jazz killing, Future you, Chill? Jazz Future Chill. Yo. Sometimes I just feel like manure. <laughs> you can choose a different word. <laughs> oh, I thought that was the one you wanted me to do. No, we can, we can switch it up. Virtual, Yo, virtual. That's that pain, man. This that pain? Virtual, virtual. Virtual pain. I'm spitting... 
virtual pain. Yo, I got a podcast spitting virtual pain. Mm-hmm. It's like they they're not in my virtual lane. Story. Give us something else, man. I ain't bro. This is the pain one, man. Okay, give me hip hop inspired. Let me inspire the youth, man. The BPM is 150. I'm my heart beat 190. <laughs> Say that, Twin. Go. Say that, Twin. Hip hop inspiring by Amza. Yo, that boy about to jump in his day Sometimes you just gotta go and believe your shit. <laughs> gotta believe your shit. Real talk. I don't care what they say, believe your shit. Your daddy said go to school, say fuck that. Go to school? No. <laughs> okay, fine, nigga, I'll go. I right, fine, I'll go. <laughs> uh, I trust okay, man. Okay, okay, go okay, to okay, page okay. five. <laughs> five? Yeah, page page maybe five. we need new keywords. Okay. Hey, that was fire though, brother. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, yeah I, I that's just one feel finger like, right there. That's one finger. Give me hip hop dirty. Yeah, you kill off fingers. <laughs> give me bouncy hip hop loop. Oh, 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 yo. oh, oh yeah, it's okay. over. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 you just want to sway to the A. You just want some freestyle. Hell. This out the dome, nigga. <laughs> listen. Oh, listen. Oh, listen. Listen. Hey. Go to school. Wait, what's the word? Thirsty, thirsty. Psych, I'm thirsty for some birds. Whoa. Okay, we are right with it. Hey, go ahead. Do we only got one 16 on this? That's perfect because I got a 16 for this. Oh, sure. I'm All right. I hear this. Give me a word and I'm going to go. It don't even owl. matter what's the word. I'm an owl in the night. Then I slide off in the night. And if I go into the pool, then I'm chilling all Fruit right. Loops. Fruit Loops in my bowl and I'm finna eat them all right. Shutter. Shutter. Don't shut your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right, bro. Look. All right. Listen, man. Let me just tap into my mind. You can ride the beat real quick. All right. Yeah. Feel him out. Let me feel him out. All right. What's the word? Download. Download my, my music. <laughs> Please, you're just saying sentences, nigga. For real. One more time. Nah, that's crazy. <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> beach, beach. <laughs> that's what happened. Bro, my brain is literally saying, "Yo, what the fuck?" <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, yeah, these are all, you know, granted, these aren't great freestyle beats. Mm. We do need like a yeah. file of just like yo, yeah. you know, you know what I mean, just yeah. pre pre vetted yeah. freestyle beats. That's a fact. Because I can do it. I believe in myself. No, definitely. It do take the right beat, man. Yeah, it takes the right beat. Writing it for yeah, you. Yeah. yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you just start going, man. Nigga, M and M mode. Oh. <laughs> Real rap, man. We gonna take our yeah. chubby hands and reach into the Discord, man. Grab up a little voice note, man. Hear from our mm-hmm. peoples, man. What's yeah. up with the Eagle community, man? Talk to me. Come on, man. Or I should say, well, let's dip in. Let's dip our beats. Oh, I, yo, I love the term wet my beak. Oh, that shit. Wet my beak, man. So you making money over there? Hey, man. What's it going to take for me to wet my beak? <laughs> That's what the airport's doing at the jacked up prices. Yo, wetting their beaks. God, yeah. they're soaking oh, beak. Wendy's are selling burgers? Crazy. What do you say we wet our beaks? Yeah. Yo, I had a junior bacon cheeseburger the other day. You was wetting your beak, huh? Holy shit. All right, man. Real rap. We got... Metal Knight, double M, double T, amen. We got a question on motivation from MK all day, man. His name is Metal Knight. It's pretty cold. That's cold. That's cold. That's cold. That's cold. cold. Damn. And play. Big love from the UK. Just wanted to let you guys know you've been shutting out with these recent podcast episodes. Like, I just saw the Lucas one. Had me in tears. I've got a question regarding, like, motivation and creativity. I DJ and I produce. I feel like I've got, like, a fond memories of how I used to produce and how I used to do things and how effortless everything seemed. But now it feels like I need to put in so much more effort to do the bare minimum uh, when it comes to, like, being creative or, like, trying to stay motivated. So my question for you is how do you guys stay creative and stay motivated and enjoy what you're doing? That'd be a big help. Love. Mm. Yeah. I feel that, man. That's an interesting. That's an interesting yeah. point, man. You said back in the day, he used to, you know, what I mean, be at his grind, and it felt way easier, way effortless. Shit, yeah, man. Shit, man. I think you definitely putting a sprinkle of discipline in there helps because I find like, yeah, sometimes when you, when you feel like it's turned off and you just like don't try to turn it back on, it just get worse. But when you just mm. kind of like keep knocking at that door eventually like you know what i'm saying it, it get oh it gets opened up and then you're producing product and you know you're back in your in your happy state yeah you know i feel that man i don't i don't think like i could i could i could remember a point where i was like 
less creative or like a moment in my life where i was less creative after being hella creative back in the day and shit and like looking back at my old shit like holy fuck like how did it did seem like way way more effortless i feel like i was just flowing and shit but that just showed me like nigga there's i'm i'm smarter than that now i'm, I'm i feel like i'm you know what i mean i know more there's like more resources for me to pull from and you know i'm, I'm taking on way more inspiration i feel like it came down to my mood and also just like you know my belief in myself i don't know i just kind of just kn knew if I, could, I could did it before i could do it now mm -hmm. you know what mm -hmm. i mean i did it when i was like way younger and i feel like when you're younger it's just you're you're, you're, you're more naive there's not there's not as much those thoughts that hold you back like yeah. you're just naive you're just going about it. you're not asking like the hard questions you're just like oh i could just do it and one plus two equals three and that is what it is mm -hmm. um and i think you lose that you get older and you just start doubting yourself all these other stupid shits start coming up and, and blocking you and then um yeah for me looking back at my old shit was to, to inspire that was an inspiration in itself just looking back at what i did right what i've already done and uh yeah you're right i think with discipline especially if you you know continue to knock at the shit on the daily or you know at least at least a regular basis yeah. you just you're one day you're just gonna crack the code in. yeah i felt like i found my formula that i was like using before and like some of those things that helped me before and then i <laughs> pull things together and I feel like I, I started to find formulas and things started to crack and just uh, feel a lot easier to me. So now I feel like I'm the most creative I've ever been. After looking back at, you know what I mean? That point where I thought, you know, that was my peak. Yeah. I'll say this, Mr. Knight. I agree with everything that was just said, but I also think we gotta be mindful as in our climate, it's like, you gotta really look at, I remember when we started saying like, okay, we gotta look at everything that's coming out look at everything that's like everyone that's doing something it's, it's just so much to take in so it's like you start seeing other people's content other people's work whether it may be like you're a dj you're an artist you're a comedian whatever it is and you're looking at their new shit and you're like fuck man that shit's not hot but you're seeing that you're seeing so many people deliver art on different levels you know what i'm saying and that alone will make you kind of like get in your second own guess, head yeah. you know what i mean a second guess your shit so mm -hmm. You got to understand that you're, you should be one of those people like inputting into that space of like, this is what I'm doing, this is what I'm doing, this is what I'm doing. Another thing is just not being, um, not being too, uh, what's the word here? Just, just, just really paying attention to, to the fact that like we're all human and there's going to be times where we burn out and you need to have that time to kind of like regroup, you know what I mean? Because if you can't just be doing this shit 100%, 100%, that's why people are getting mad at Frank Ocean for taking a break. Like, regardless of how long that break may be for him. He may need it to make the level of shit that he makes. Yeah, you know what I mean? So, it, yeah, part of the formula. Yeah, people get a little bit too caught up in the fact of like always having to do something where it's just like that's why you're burning out. Because like there's been times where we chilled for a minute on content that we came back we're like, all right, regrouped, we're good. Like, let's go now. You know, I think it's a it's a lot of different ways. Like it's it's okay to be just chilling for a little bit and trying to find that or whatever that spark again yeah. and then when you find it it's just gonna roll like the ball's just gonna roll sometimes man it's just it's just not time it's just time to maybe do some research and then come back to the drawing board you know yeah i think that could be it could be an exciting moment too it doesn't have to be like a dull moment like ah oh, man i feel like i'm not mm, quite at it i'm not where i used to be whatever it's just like yeah that's a challenge to like get there and surpass that yeah and like it's just a puzzle you got to solve and figure out because it's possible you did it you reached heights before and you could do it again and it's gonna be new heights that's the you know what I mean? Outdo what you did before. Mm. Try new ideas. And on top of that, looking at a, spa a, a crowded space, everyone's making music, everyone's producing and shit. Like, it's exciting to find out, yeah, how do I stand out? How do I do a little bit different? Like, what, what are these niggas not doing? Who's, you know what I mean? What are they missing that I can, like, you know, sneaky, you know, grab a sneaky, you know, mm -hmm. take at? Mm -hmm. You know nice. what I mean? So, yeah, I think it's yeah. a, I think have fun with it. Enjoy the puzzle. Mm. You know what I mean? And overall, I think just enjoy it, man. Yeah. Even if you're not. I say ch like ch chip away at it and, and grind at it, but it doesn't mean like drop everything that you produce. You know what I mean? Just enjoy the work in itself, and yeah. you know what I mean. You're just naturally gonna discover some cold shit. And <clears throat> it be the serendipity, man. The shit that you're not, you're not when you're not like, what is it? It's the shit you're taking a shower. So, Damn, I heard a little, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then you know what I mean? Yeah. Sure, or just a, your little your little doodle of a of a beat, if you will, mm -hmm. that just ends up being something. So. Don't force it, man. Just, Keep at it, man. Enjoy it. Yeah. Let it come here. I'll leave it at that. That's nice. All day, man. Oh. Yep. 
All day, man, all day. You know what it is, man. It's been a very wholesome episode of the Random Order Show 147, man. Amen. Y'all know what you need to do, man, to support the cause. Amen. Jump in them comments, man. Jump on that like button, man. Jump on that bell button, man. Hop on the, the Spotify, Apple Podcast, man. Leave them great five star reviews. Amen. You know what it is, man. Hey, man. Leave them something inspiring about shrimp. Hey, man. Listen, you you either going to get dipped. Or flip <laughs> <laughs> Like Dipped in, in cocktail sauce Or flipped on the grill man So you might as mm-hmm. well Keep on swimming Bruh Yeah Well said man You either gonna get Peeled or popped <laughs> they, It's not time. that good for shrimp <laughs> 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 like, They're going out Any way you put it man I think yeah Okay just chill man That's the most the shrimp can do man Just chill bro <laughs> <laughs>